Hello everyone, welcome back to Denver Beard Reviews. Thank you all for stopping by the channel, checking out this video. If you could, please like, subscribe, and of course share with your bearded friends. Today's episode, I'm bringing back a company that, that I did a review on last year. Um, has some amazing quality ingredients, some awesome scents, and we're going to jump into a new scent profile that they just released. Today's episode is based on Lucky 13 Beard Co. out of New Jersey. Please stand by after the short introduction, and I'll jump right into the review. guys welcome back and again thank you all for stopping by the channel today's episode again is based on lucky 13 beard co out in new jersey and specifically their sinful profile lucky 13 is based out of new jersey their owner's name is ed they make some top-notch beard products with quality ingredients and some awesome scent profiles and at a price point that anyone can afford after the review, guys, please check out these products. I'll leave a link there in the description below so you can check out their website. To start off with, um, we'll talk about the one ounce beard oil and the sinful profile. One ounces will run you $13. That's an absolute steal with a beard product, the industry average commonly being $15 to $20. So this is even below the average. So awesome price point. You can also get the butters for $13 or you can get a combo with an oil and a butter together for $24 and save you a couple bucks. So absolute steal. Um, your wallet and your wife will thank you by using Lucky 13's products. In the sinful profile, again, he, all of his oils come in a amber glass bottle with a black dropper top. Labels are absolutely awesome. He either has just a common black with the logo and uh, ingredients list with scent profile. Um, however, for the sinful profile, he has this awesome graphic in the background. Um, looks like the the moon back there with a bunch of clouds and it's all in a red coloring just really really cool art artwork used on this profile on one side you have the scent profile breakdown and then on the other just the ingredients list the ingredients of the oil are almond oil jojoba oil apricot oil metaphone seed oil castor oil and fragrance oils for the profile um, the consistency of the oil, it's a medium consistency with a almost absolutely clear profile, just a light yellow haze in it. Really, really nice consistency. The breakdown of the scent profile is sweet tobacco, grapefruit, and teak wood. When smelling it, you it, it comes off clean on the front end, real nice and clean. You get that tobacco on the front end and a little bit of the teak wood. The only thing that I find myself personally, just because I'm a, a fruit freak, I love my fruit profiles. I would like to see a little bit of the grapefruit come out more. Um, it is in there and you get a slight tanginess or um, citrusy note in there from the grapefruit. I just wish it came out a little more. Um, you do get the teakwood and the tobacco and it comes off oddly clean. I guess with the grapefruit in there, it brings the profile to almost a cologne style without those top notes making it an actual cologne profile. Just real nice. If you like tobacco um, with a little bit of teakwood, um, and it, it's got 
a little bit of a uniqueness characteristic to it to make it like a clean note type profile. I would definitely recommend this one. I actually love it. Again, I would like a little more of the fruit component come out. Um, however, this profile is really, really nice. And the, the thing that really stuck out to me was this label when I first seen it. Just absolutely awesome. And then again, he actually even changed the color of his logo to black and red instead of black and orange and white. So really nice touch, really clean profile. Lasts you about six hours in beard. Feels great in beard. Real good moisturizing characteristics. No itchiness, no dryness whatsoever, guys. Um, just a real good oil with an awesome scent profile. Um, lasts you about six hours total in beard. Uh, and for $13, guys, you got to give this one a try. Just a really, really good profile. I really enjoyed it. Um, the butter comes in an amber glass jar with a black plastic screw off top. Consistency, nice and creamy. Um, almost a off-white collar. Ingredients for the butter is shea butter, mango butter, almond oil, jojoba oil, apricot oil, metaphoam seed oil, castor oil, beeswax, and fragrance oils for their profile. Um, same profile, the sweet tobacco, grapefruit, and teakwood. <clears throat> the uh, longevity as well as the strength of the profile is similar strengths on both sides from the butter and the oil. You don't get that off-putting um, note of the shea butter in this at all being the main ingredient. He, do, he does a real good job at covering up the shea in this. Just real good notes. Um, again, I, I find myself still wanting more of that grapefruit note, but that's also just a personal preference. Uh, I put butter in at night, guys, and I was able to smell it. Um, when I did get eight hours of sleep, I didn't smell it that morning. However, if I had a short night, got out about six, got about six hours of sleep. I did smell it when I first woke up in the morning as well. Um, real nice profile. Ed's really hit it out of the park again. All of his products are amazing. You have to check them out. Um, I'll leave a link to their shop in the description below. You can actually use the code DENVER10 for 10% off uh, your order there with Lucky 13. This is just a discount code for my viewers, guys. I do not benefit from this monetarily in any way. It's just to help you all save a few dollars in your pocket. Um, again, great quality ingredients, awesome products, feel amazing in the beard. And um, when only paying $24 for a combo, guys, your uh, your wallet and your wife will thank you. Uh, again, guys, please tell Lucky13 that uh, Denver Beard Review sent you, and I look forward to seeing you all on the next episode. Hope you have a great rest of your day, and take care. See you.